This is the high pressure turbine, but it's the smallest. If uh, the way steam's created, we warm it up, warm water up to about uh, 1,005 degrees, and we pressurize it to 2,800 pounds per square inch. Then it goes into that steam turbine and it expands as it releases its energy. Then we send it back up to the boiler to be reheated to 1,005 degrees, and when it comes back to the turbine, it's about 550 pounds per square inch and enters right here in the center of the intermediate pressure turbine and then flows both ways out and exhausts through these exhaust ports and then it's reused again in these low pressure turbines. It enters these low pressure turbines at about 500 degrees Fahrenheit and about 150 pounds per square inch and then flows out and exhausts into this area of the condenser um, which is below atmospheric pressure and the steam's down to about 120 degrees by the time it gets here. So we've taken all of the energy out that we put in and then we'll send that water back to the boiler to start the whole cycle over again.